last, last four months, lot of accomplishments are done in this area. And the first uncrewed mission, G1, is going to be lifted off this year end, maybe close to December. And in that, the Biomitra, a half humanoid, you can see the photograph, that is going to fly. And coming to ISROs and Axiom's International Space Station program, we have sent the second Indian to space and first Indian to International Space Station. The, our Gaganyatri Sukhalaji is with us. And thanks to Honorable Prime Minister, it was his vision. He only announced this program in June 2023. He strongly felt when it comes to Gaganyan program, this activity will really add a lot of value to that. And this program was announced by him. And you can see on June 25th, the launch was successfully done. And docking was done on June 26th. And Gaganyatri, Sukhalaji interacted with Honorable Prime Minister, with the school children. And the undocking was successfully done. And splashdown was successfully done. And they arrived back safely to India on August 17. And in this, the ISRO team had a crucial role to play. In fact, I want to say, number one, this entire contract based on the direction and guideline from Honorable Prime Minister and our minister, the ISRO team effectively did. And another important thing is, originally, the mission was targeted on 11th June. And 10th June, we came to know there was a leakage in the Falcon rocket. It was ISRO team which insisted for complete correction. Based on ISRO team insistence, the complete correction was done by the US SpaceX team, and we had accomplished successfully. But for that complete correction, it would have ended up with a catastrophic situation. And thereby, we have saved the life of four of the astronauts. And I'm proud to say that Indian education system, under the leadership of our Honorable Prime Minister and ISRO training, has proved that we are second to none even in stopping a faulty rocket and ensuring safety of the astronauts. And our Gaganyatri, Mr. Sukraji, has effectively carried out seven experiments. We are going to dwell a little later on that in human health, space biotechnology, space agriculture, and astronaut nutrition, space biology. And in fact, this is going to feed huge wealth of data for the Indian science. 